I'm Madhu Govindarajan, and I work in technical marketing at the MathWorks. I help program the three projects in the Arduino engineering kit. The nice thing about MATLAB and Simulink is that they are built for engineers, which means that it was easy to implement the math and the engineering calculations behind these projects. So you can build some pretty cool Arduino projects without being an expert programmer. For the drawing robot, MATLAB's math and image processing routines were used to convert images into a series of line segments that the robot needs to draw. After calculating where the markers should move, MATLAB controls the DC motors accordingly to draw the image on a whiteboard. In the self-balancing motorcycle project, I first imported the CAD drawings into Simulink and used that to simulate and understand the behavior of the motorcycle itself. Then, a controller was designed that can keep the bike upright by just changing the speed of the inertial wheel. Once we got the bike balancing, in the simulation world, we moved to an Arduino and interactively tuned the controller until we had the actual bike itself balancing. With Simulink, we could quickly design the control algorithm and then automatically generate the code that gets deployed on the Arduino with just the click of a button. In the mobile rover project, we programmed the rover to follow a series of path instructions and to pick up and drop off an object with just its forklift. To track the rover's location, we built a localization algorithm in MATLAB and used that along with the rover's encoder data. This project also uses an add-on product that's called Stateflow to model the rover's different operating states. For instance, when it is turning or moving forward or to drop the forklift and so on. So I hope you try out these projects and see how MATLAB and Simulink can help you incorporate more engineering into your Arduino projects. Thank <laughs> you.